exciting day for Kiko Man's Kitchen. We have the finalists for our Latina Blogger Recipe Contest. These women came from all over the U.S. and Canada. We received about 70 recipes and I selected the top three. The ladies are here now cooking up a storm so we can taste how they let Kiko Man spice up their life. Rodriguez, I, I am with the Estilo Familiar and I, I get the opportunity to make the new recipes that I call Sushi Caribeño and I got inspired uh, in my Latin uh, background, my heritage that is from the Caribbean, from Puerto Rico. The Kikoman soy sauce is different and more light so it doesn't overwhelm the recipe that you are making up. So I like to in, uh, integrate those uh, ingredients in the recipe and I got the Sushi car uh, Caribeño. I was really surprised of being selected by Chef Helen as a winner of the Kikoman Sabor Challenge and I was able to come here to San Francisco with the two more Latin bloggers and I had a great experience in the kitchen. I, feel, I felt the pressure of cooking in front of a lot of people. <laughs> so I know uh, the experience but at the end it was, uh, I was able to make the sushi caribe uh, caribeño and then Chef Helen uh, gave me a lot of tips about how to make it better. So it was a great experience and I'm very glad to, to be here. What umami does to the tongue, it opens up your taste buds and you get more flavor in. It is not the flavor itself. It's actually your body is reacting to it. Hi, my name is Sandra Perez. Uh, I'm a Hispanic blogger. My blog is Mama Noticias. I have the opportunity to come here to the Chef Helen and prepare my tacos de lechuga. I get inspired for my husband because he loves the tacos and my son loves the Asian food and I find the perfect combination to get a healthy food because I use lettuce for the tacos instead of tortillas and I'm happy to share with my, my readers about the, the Latin um, uh, kitchen using the Kikoman products and in this case I use the soy sauce and the rice vinegar to my tacos de lechuga. I'm so excited to be here in San Francisco in the Kiko My headquarters because I know, uh, uh, I learn about the products. They have a variety for, especially for the Latinas, we can add that, the, that products are favorite dishes. What do you recommend for the barbecue? Um, pork roast, the chicken, and even the beef, like a, um, and ribs. Oh. And when you brine it at least four hours or overnight. I always put it in the cooler with ice. That's what I call layering the flavors from the inside out. Hi, I'm Nancy and I blog at whisperinspirations.com and today I'm at Kiko Man's headquarters and I got to meet Chef uh, Helen Roberts and uh, cook our special dishes that we made with Kiko Man sauces. Uh, I'm very happy to be one of the winners. To make my dish today, I made a cerichada and I paired it with Spanish rice and uh, a garden salad and I used the Kiko Man teriyaki sauce and the Kiko Man lime ponzu sauce to marry two different flavors and make one dish that you know pleases both and uh, I discovered that Kiko Man soy sauce actually has less sodium than you know salt <laughs> and for me I like to keep uh, low sodium and make low sodium dishes so for me that's an awesome discovery. All the way watches Jenny Craig they all use a lot of powdered soy sauce in their frozen entrees. Wow. You guys are eating you're into something really hot already. <laughs>